action. Well, well, you can hear old Lennox in the background, but anyways, I had to do a little bit of work to the old crap dozer, and uh, here we go. Get the motion light to work. I uh, took the grinder and grinded off some of the metal that's kind of top of the blade there from pushing all that snow. Sure did scrape a lot of metal off. And I guarantee it really was off of a car because I showed it to a, one of the neighbors just, I don't know, a couple hours ago or so. Oh, man, a little bit out of breath because I was running. <laughs> Yeah, I shortened the chain so now the blade's a lot higher and I don't have to, now I don't keep digging in the ground. Now if I want to lower the blade I have to pull this all the way down now. Still got the old 12 horse motor. Yeah, I gotta get a mounting bolt for it. The motor's kind of shaking a little bit. Yeah, it's got three mounting bolts and there's supposed to be four so hoping I get one on but Three is better than nothing, or else the motor would be going all over the place. <laughs> yep, still got the old black gas tank. I wish I had the clear one, just like the 94 Sears, because I have a clear gas tank in that. Oh well. I'll keep it all original. Keep it all original as possible. So I figured I'd give you, make you a video of what I did with the old craft dozer. I shorten the chain so the blade be a lot higher go ahead and lift it up like I was gonna go drive it there we go a little piece of metal for the notch is kind of busted so I can't keep it at level six no more so it's at level five that sucks but oh well better than having it all the way down and can't keep it up <laughs> yeah and all this pretty much all the snow melted so no more plowing I'll still take the old girl for the out for a spin. And I hope I didn't bend the metal or a little or anything. Looks like it's kind of bent a little bit. Because I but nah, it might be because of the back left tire. It might be a little bit low on air. I think that's why. Anyways, yeah, I gotta tell you when I was plowing I was not recording the incident that happened I was plowing plowing along this happened yesterday Thanksgiving USA and I was on the Maxfield Bridge and once I got to the end of the bridge where them two notches are there's a little hole there the blade fell right into it and I smacked it so hard the blade actually bounced up and landed right back on the asphalt it was crazy it was a hard hit too. Kind of hit my gut a little bit too. Just that 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 strike feeling when I strike the that that notch. Whew! I could feel it as soon as I hit it. But anyways, figure I give you a heads up in the old craft dozer. So y'all have a good day and a good night and bye bye.